In this lecture, I am going to discuss about how to run C, C++ codes in C line. So, open Google search box right there, C line. Then, go to JetBrains site. You can see C line that's available for 13 days trial. Click there. So, now here you can see C line 2023. This executor file is now downloading. So it will only take uh, 15 times to complete the download. The size is 661 MB. See the file 654 MB that's done. And only second, few seconds are left to complete the download. So that's done here. Click on this executor file. Click on this next, next, C line, desktop icon, that's for, this is for path, this is for project, and this is for header file, for C, this one, dot H, dot C, CVP, I think this not required, but you can do, and after doing this, click on next, and that JetBrains, that's fine, click on install. So this is now installing the C line on your Windows operating system. This has almost done and now the C line that installed successfully. Click on this finish. After that click on C line this icon that's created dot import and now this is opening. And this here, I'm going to use the free trial. So click here, a start trial. This new project. And this place you can run C file, C++ file. This all you can do, this places. And here, you need to give the project name. So first running uh, C, so C project giving the name. This location where C project going to create. So here selecting C, C11 that's selected. By default, click on this create. And here automatically min GW that's taken. Because if I open the command prompt and uh, here if I write G++ minus minus version then you can get this all so mean gw is there or if i write here gcc so mean gw this version that is installed so first you need to install the mean gw that's why it's automatically it's taken the compiler by default and here you can see mean gw is there so mean gw you need to install first after that to uh, it will automatically detect this all. So this detect here, environment, min GW, and toolset, and this here, CMake, and our debugger version 13, that's taken. So it's automatically detecting this all. So when that all detected here, so here you can see detected G++, GCC, this all because min gw installed so first you need to install the min gw now click on this ok and this is the code to print the hello world so if i right click then click on this run untitled hello world this displaying and thereafter i am going to test here add two number codes this place add two number on C first you need to save that then right click then run untitled so this is asking about to enter first number 6 8 14 this is display ok see it's working fine then after now creating one new project so this time I'm going to select here C and here let's 
give you the name meaningful CPP project. So C++ is going to run there. It's this one taken. That's fine. Click on this create. This window. So C++ that's come there. First you need to just here or click on this run run cpv project hello world that's displaying and uh, here i have the code uh, for add two numbers using c++ so c++ this code is there paste there then after save first and right click or let's go on this run run cpp project here you uh, just enter uh, to number 8 plus 5 that's displaying 30 so here C and C++ both are working uh, better on C line so this is how we can run so this is how we can run C and C++ codes inside C line so I hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you